because uh, we are reaching from Biafra land and we are here to restore the land of the rising sun, Biafra. So please do call in and make your contribution. Let's know your take. How did it go in your area? What is going on um, now? Uh, what is the result? You know, most times after we um, carry out our activities, after our recorded victory, you see them trying to molest people, trying to arrest our people. So we want to know what is going on in your environment, wherever you are. Please call us. Let's hear from you. Call us on Skype, call us on Facebook, call us on WhatsApp, and of course on Skype. We are everywhere. We want to hear from you. We want to hear from you, both in Biafra land. And of course, um, you know, when we talk about the heroes, the leaders of them in diaspora, it was it was great. You know, we followed so many of them. Of course, uh, they did marvelously well, if, including our onion do, you know. I mean, the people, the spirit have been revitalized and they revived all around. And uh, it's connecting as one spirit all around the world. It was quite uh, resonating. Okay, we'll have a call on the phone. Hello. Yeah, uh, my name is uh, Mazi Chima Joseph Onye, who I'm calling from Sukasari de Karmona, University of the Afro Land. You're welcome. Uh, Please tell us what happened in Enugu on that day. Yeah, hello. We can hear you, go ahead. Uh, my, yes, uh, so my name is Mazi Chima Joseph Onye, who calling from Sukasari de Karmona, University of the Afro Land. I'm calling from Sukasari de Karmona, the <laughs> But the I I not there enough. They can't do it again. That our own belongs to our own. But I saw women want to go cover my middle thing on it. We not from the government that thing. We go from my that there. The other one my own koala. All the other my all the other my. But I am not going to do this. I am ready to restore my land. Nothing can take it away from me again. All the money I have to have in summer. But if you watch it in here, I am who did you call Nigeria shake on that and um, before is the target me. To show you how powerful I feel And I encourage every one of us for us to remain so rich. Don't look back. Yes, because I know that you are now entering into the door of our freedom. Gana <laughs> all right, we have another caller there on the phone. Hello. Hello. Yes, good morning. What's your name? Where are you Hello. <laughs> Can you please turn down the volume of the listening device? Hello. Sorry. Hello. Sorry, please turn down the volume of the listening device and call. Hello, call on When he arrived in the United States. He told them about the world orders and so many things that is going to happen. And could Tell us what's up, can you hear me? Hello. We, 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 are, we are supreme beyond all these things. Hello, can you hear me? We are not like these people. We are not like them. We are special. There is something we need to do. In our land, in Afghan land, we bring in, whenever we see things happen like evil, 
people being killed, that is when we, we, we bring them up for danger, for revenge. Let our leaders, let them order every Biafran all over the entire world. There is something we must do. Let us just raise the sand and call the spirit of Biafran. Be know that all over the entire world, through slavery, through any persecutions, through the bombardment of Biafran citizens in the land of Biafra. Let us do it. When we do it and hand them over canes and brooms, I bet you the whole world, they will sweep out all these evil, evil plans against our people. That is just the beginning, because I know they will do it. Please, as we are hearing this voice, I want you to, to beg, beg our leaders, let them think about this. Let them give us just one day. One day is enough for every Biafran, over the entire world. Let us fight this fight and get our revenge. That is the, that is the way I believe that we will, we will deal with you and other world leaders. They, they don't believe that spirits of Biafrans can, can attack them, can hurt them, can do anything. We don't die. We recanate. We live forever. That is one thing. But them, they don't. They can never be like us. So please, tell our leaders, give them this idea. Let them, let them give us one day. One day is enough. In the upper land is where you see a woman, a man who will be using his parents for ritualists. In blood, killing so many things. It's happening. Many people will go and serve their, their, their orders and they will be useless. This, all these things are happening in the land. Your organizers are there showing every effort we are doing to get Biafra because of money. These people are not supposed to be living with us. Let us sweep these people out from our means. Let us be white, 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 whiter than whiter than snow. Let us be pure. We don't need to have all these, all these groups around us. Let us come out and proclaim, yes, we are the children of Chukwa Abiyama, as we always do, because we are. Please, I beg you, to tell our leaders, let them give us one day. Let all the Biafrans all over the world, from child to old, let us awake our spirits, the spirit of our people, of our great men and women, ancestors, all over the entire world, even though they die through slavery. Arise. You will see what is going to happen in UN. You will see what is going to happen all over the entire world. Then they will know that we are not the kind of people they can form, they can plan for war order or Islamization through their, their terrorist leader, Saudi Arabia and Iran. Thank you very no, much. It's not Thank possible. you very much. We'll have very to much. Come back on. Thank you. Okay, we'll have a call on the phone. Hello. All right, thank you very much. Please do call back and then let's hear your contribution. Let's know your take on the issue. Of course, you said um, the leadership should give us one day, and of course, to, for us to, I think it's something different from the Heroes Day, he said for us to, a kind of invocation, kind of... Yes, 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 I got, I, I got his point, as in he was really making a, a whole lot of sense. And he's if, spiritual. Yes, um, I mean, that sound that he mentioned, because uh, that is the product, the main ingredients that we are made with, and those people that died, it is still that sound they return to. So, if everybody all over the world that is a Biafran, in America, USA, Canada, England, in all the whole continent of the world, they can collect all the sand in that very place, it's both in Biafran land and everything, and bring all of them in one place and make a pronouncement. Believe you me, something significant will happen. So it's a very nice idea, and I think if the leadership can also look into that, I think uh, he, he made a very, I mean, a very nice uh, suggestion there. And, uh, it, okay, it, Mazi Elvis, what do you have to say about that, please? Can you react to his um, contribution? Um, my sister, what the brother said, I didn't caption it very well, but um, I will follow what my brother uh, just said because it seems like uh, he, he, I heard him clearly from what the yeah. brother said. What um, uh, the idea is a welcome idea, and um, if the, the leadership, if our leadership can kind of uh, adopt it and um, it work 
it will work if we can uh, adopt such. It's uh, a very nice idea, and um, it works individually. I talk more of when we do it collectively, Pia France, both worldwide, everywhere. In short, you will see the reaction. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Of course, um, there are some things the leadership need to look into. Uh, they are really important, and of course, um, because the leadership is doing, really, they are doing their best. They are doing their best, and uh, that is why we keep asking you to make your contribution. We keep asking for your opinion, because the leadership is taking them down, and of course, uh, in due course, I think uh, it will be, um, you know, it will be adhered to if there is need for it. So do call us and make a contribution. Call us and let's hear your opinion. What is going on in your environment right now? What is going on there? Okay, we still have the case of uh, 140 peer friends in Enugu prisons. They are not yet released. Um, what could be going on? Or what, what really, uh, why are they not released yet? Okay, well, uh, the, uh, our brothers and uh, our old parents and uh, all our uh, gallant men and women that are still under detention, you know, w uh, you know, we, our hearts, uh, we felt uh, you, you really what they are feeling because we are still in the same prison with them, but in different cells, so we, we, we can still feel their pains. And uh, by the grace of Chukwu Kabiyama, our legal department, they are doing everything normally possible to make sure they get out because they didn't commit any offense. And this at home um, by which they have they went out for to evangelize and to also educate people who have come and gone so they don't still have any reason to you know detain them there i know they are bringing up some useless and unscrupulous uh, ag arguments that uh, they are trying to <laughs> overthrow jubril in Asorok without anything just with their different flag that is to tell you how foolish nigerian system of government is and uh, how foolish the people that call themselves the lawyers and their learned colleagues are because uh, they don't reason like human being how can old people who is al almost approaching 80 years uh, you know overthrow Jibril uh, from Sudan are we fighting for Biafra or are we fighting for one Nigeria so that is tell you how bad they are but uh, that notwithstanding uh, people should uh, be courageous I know some of them are hearing what I'm saying be courageous uh, we are doing everything we have not abandoned you IPOB is doing everything in their power to make sure that you get out of that place as soon as possible because it's not easy to bring 140 people and pack them in one particular place you know it is very very horrible and I know how I've been in that situation before and I know how horrible you guys must have felt I know the pace that people are going through and even your families but that notwithstanding hold on this is one, one of the things we experience in this very world that we are in but I can assure you that victory will be, will be ours in no distant time. If Chukwu Kabiyama and our ancestors can be part of the city at home, making it a success, a success. And I want to assure you that your effort is not in vain because what you are arrested for, what, what you are incarcerated for is, you know, being actualized and it is being achieved in a 100% foot. And our enemies have already confirmed that. So I want to assure you to hold on tight. IPOB never abandon has, uh, abandons her own, so you are never going to be abandoned in any way. We are coming for you, and uh, you will get out of there as soon as possible. Thank you very much. That's All right, thank you so much. Call on the phone. Hello. What city are you calling from? Can you please see that you are listening to us? Hello. Please, if anybody is there. Sorry, we can't take um, that call because you've uh, refused to adhere to the instructions. Please, before you call on this platform, ensure you tune down the volume of your listening device. They're not listening. They, they are not listening at all. Please tune it down so that we can hear you listening. very well. We can have um, an effective communication. Thank you very much. So call us on WhatsApp, call us on uh, phone line, call us on Skype. Uh, call us on Facebook. Let's hear your contribution. Let's hear your opinion. Let's also know how you um, honored the 30th of May. How did it go in your area? How did it happen? You know, the, the Nigerian media, they are full of lies. They, they all, you know, by the time they get their brown envelope, you see them reporting trash. You see them reporting rubbish. We, we had the videos, um, the pictures coming from Delta State, where everywhere were deserted. But now they are coming to say that there was, um, you know, business we are going on and on and on. You know, they, they try to um, malign our efforts. They twist try to them. twist the truth. 
that is what is obtainable in the contraption called Nigeria. And the question is, what will it fetch them? That is, that is the question. What will it fetch them? Why are they trying to hide the truth? Okay, we'll have a call out there. Hello. We lost that call. Okay, uh, Mazi Elvis, what do you... Um, yes. Yeah, what, what do you think it will fetch them, you know, trying to malign our effort, trying to twist the truth? Even when the deed has been yeah. done. Um, my sister, the, the, the truth is not far fetched from uh, their reactions. You know, um, if you don't have a patronizer, someone that patronizes your business, you, your business must surely shut down. But when you have someone that is patronizing you, which means you are encouraged to continue peddling lies, you know, uh, 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 marketing expired drugs, you know, helping the masses to die untimely. So, uh, he, he, for my own uh, uh, perspective, all these people are irrelevant, and uh, people that carry their news are helping them to peddle lies. And if Biafrans could listen to the voice of our leader that has said it long time ago, that we should boycott this newspaper. We have our own. We have Biafran, uh, Biafran uh, 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 Herald. We have Biafran Times. Please, go there as a Biafran. Read this news. This way ones are meant for Nigerians. Are meant for the zoo. We are lie. You know, give birth to, to all manner of heinous crime where your CDs are not recognized, where your children are being molested, where your right and your destiny are being buried by so-called cabal. So you don't need to listen to these people and their radio stations. You know, they are demons. They are not there to help you. So I don't, I don't give them a kind of, uh, whatever thing they like, they, they, that is their own business. Because I don't pay them. All right, thank you. Thank you very much. So, to you, what do they stand to gain? Trying to um, uh, okay. you know, twist the whole thing. Okay. What, of what gain is it to the Nigerian government? Well, they are making a whole lot of gain from it. You know, when you talk about gain, but it depends on what they are gaining. That is uh, another issue. You know, sometimes uh, they gain more deception and they gain more. You know, they say if you sow um, a cockatrice egg, I mean, I mean, I mean, if you hatch a cockatrice egg, then be ready for a snake bite. So that is to tell you that uh, you know what someone is sowing is what they, they are going to reap. Definitely, you know, they are gaining lies and deception and uh, momentary enjoyment. Wow. Wow, Hello, come on the phone. Good morning from here. Let's go, cousin. I bless you. You say bless you too. I don't know when I'm coming out clearly. Yes, you are. We can hear you. Go ahead. Okay, okay. Sorry, sorry, please. I want to thank you, cousin, for the peaceful conduct of Remembrance Day. And we also condole with our family members, even the one that we lost in our Bakaliki local government that hero's day and i want to use this opportunity to condole the family members the man has also paid an ultimate sacrifice towards the restoration of Biafra. and i want to thank uh, elohim because of our candlelight it was very very peaceful and we had a very pleasant candle night and we remember our spirit of our heroes and we have told them that we have done all we have what we need to do humanly possible and they should continue the quest for us towards the expression of their family. I want to thank our family members and our donors at school and our state provincial coordinator and every member Okay, we lost that call. We lost the call. Do call us back. Call us on Skype. Our Skype and Facebook ID is at Sunrise BTV. Our Skype and Facebook ID at Sunrise BTV. So please do call us and uh, make your contributions. We'll have a call on Facebook. Hello. Hello. Good morning. Thank you very much. Good morning from here. What's the name? Where are you calling from? Yes, thank you, Madam Gozi and uh, Anzi Victor Onido. And uh, brother uh, Mazeb is all the way. Yes, sir. My name is Mr. Mel Okudrechukwu Mwafo. 
I'm calling you from the United Kingdom, precisely London. Yes, I want to use this opportunity to appreciate uh, all their friends worldwide and uh, all the IPOD families by obeying the call of sit at home on the 30th of May for honor, I mean to honor our, 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 our heroes and heroines. I want to appreciate them all for those that obey sit at home. And we pray that you could carry a man through this at home that our land, the African nation, shall be restored in the mighty name of Chukwuki Kabiyama. Okay. Yes, sir. Yes, uh, I want to uh, contribute on the on the news you read this morning by what Nigeria, uh, 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 um Gota Media. Uh, we are saying that uh, IPOB shots uh, killed five people. So, uh, I, I mean, uh, I, I think it's no longer news now because the Yoruba Gota media, they hate their friends and everything that IPOB stands for. If you remember, the last time um, Woko was reported that. Uh, uh, they said that Woko, Woko was uh, Bishop um, is it, uh, Pastor Woko was killed more than, and uh, they saw him uh, in the, he was killed and left in a pool of blood and there's no evidence of a video you know to justify their claims and when IPOB decided to, to hit the matter and uh, there is nothing of such they find out they, 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 they find out that it's nothing of such. So Yoruba should mind their business. They should go and fight for their we'll do the one nation and let their friends be. Because we are fighting to restore I mean to free ourselves from that damnable zoological republic. We want to separate ourselves from that evil contraption. They say criminal, they are, they call us all manner of names. And we say okay. These people are tired of the Biafra. We said we want to go, and yet he said no. So what is their problem? They should stop reporting evil. They don't have anything good to report about Biafra and IPOB. They should desist from things that concern us. So that's my piece of advice to them, because we are already go, we are already we are already on our way to exit to that, uh, that that contraption. We don't want them. We don't need them. Whatever they, whatever thing they, they, uh, uh, they said they want to offer us, we, we are not interested. So they should go and mind their businesses. Because we be friends, we know exactly what we want. And we are heading home. Thank you. That is just my little contribution this morning. And God bless you all. Bless you too. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Of course, we are heading home. We are not scared of their you know the accusations they try to accuse us when they try to stop us and uh, we are unstoppable they bring up one lie or the other to stop us or to do whatever okay so go ahead please okay um you, you know just like uh, what i was saying you know from uh, the antecedent of uh, you know what our people have been able to achieve so far it goes a long way to show you and the rest of the world that uh, ipob truly this uh, of this generation is truly formidable not just by men spoken with but by action, by our antecedent, by our determination, you know, to free ourselves from this slavery. I know, just like my brother mentioned, you know, the, 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 the Yorubas are slaves and they are born to be slaves forever because if not, they would have minded their own business of how to liberate themselves than what they stand to gain in the zoo because they are still definitely going to lose every single thing they are going to gain by, you know, a fighting and antagonizing IPOB. You can imagine, they are paying them one one naira, two two naira, the one they paid them in 2016, in 2017. And 2018, and yet they are still hungry. They are still the people crying about hungry, crying about uh, losing billions, you know, in, in because of the fact that uh, they, they don't have hope, they don't have aspiration, they don't have vision, even you know, to inspire their own people to do something and uh, uh, forget whatever because IPB is not minding them. Because believe you me, any day IPB will wake up and say, Yoruba man is here, is their problem that want to face them, want to pull them down. They won't even last for, for, for one minute in any way. But we are minding our own business, our business. 
business is to restore Biafra and nothing more. So anybody that is fighting us will definitely go down. Thank you. Thank you. Call on the phone. Hello. Hello. Yeah, good morning. What's the name? Where are you calling from? Hello. Hello. May we know your name and where you are calling from? Hello. Hello. Good morning. Good morning to you. Hello. Hello. Okay, you're listening to your device. That's why you cannot hear us. Please, when you call, ensure you tune down the volume of your listening device so we can have an effective communication. It's really, really important. Uh, if you call and you're still listening to your television or to your radio set or to, your, uh, to the phone you are using, you will not hear us and won't communicate very well. So please do adhere to the instructions. Very important. Okay, um... Let me call the numbers again for you. The, the numbers to call on WhatsApp line is 090-566-08-583. Our WhatsApp line, once again, 090-566-08-583. And our phone line is 070-203-53706. Call on the phone. Hello. Hello, call on the phone. Can you hear me? Hello, call on Skype. Uh, good morning, what are you Yeah, go ahead. Welcome to the program. Uh, my name is Isuchuku calling from Miguacha. And good morning, Maze Victor and the Maze Evie. Good morning, what's your name? I'm going to make a living in my own name. I'm going to make a living in my own but I see me hero there in Subiano, but I got a primary and with this. Make a look on the look you see, I have one on the carlo. Make a look by Martin Mefan, the African rep, George Unibi. And make a lady man on a bow on a bumbo, well, well, and the man in a try in a lap yafra. Then I should be a man by you, me. Thank you. Thank you very much. Of course, um, you know, we are, we are glad that the Tetet me has come and gone and it was peaceful. So, those of them accusing IPOB of killings, um, you know, it's really laughable. It, 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 they didn't stop at telling lies that they weren't, they weren't compliant. Now they went as far as accusing us of, mo uh, you know, mother of five people. It's really laughable. Hello, call on WhatsApp. Uh, hello, good morning, uh, our great sister, uh, and Spoka, uh, and Marzi. Victor, how you doing? Good morning. Uh, okay. All hey, Biafra, all hey, Biafra worldwide. Biafra. Uh, my name is Ikenichiko. I'm coming from uh, Malaysia. I uh, want to thank uh, every Biafra and uh, all lovers of freedom worldwide. You know what happens on Tatet, on Tatet May 2019 is a great civic event and a great victory. We went to IPOB. We need to indigenous people of Biafra. They are trying to divert it. Uh, they are saying they are trying to say they want to make a documentary for Nigeria civil war. They are trying to make it look like the world see them that like they, they are into they are, they are together because they already see what happened. But uh, my contribution about uh, what uh, uh, you pass uh, media, uh, we we know we don't. Uh, I think I would to you know to criticize you on what you are doing it means that what you are doing is nothing and this is why you are fighting we call it fighting you know we are fighting just you know back on what they are doing by this is what they know that from the beginning they told us that people don't love themselves but they already see that people already love themselves so I, I really thank you people and thank all the Japanese social those in Japan that make, make it possible that they run all over the Japan land video all this case. So all that thing they are saying is, 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 is for them, it's not for us. The world is already see what happened internationally and locally is not, it's beyond to them. 
You know, so what they are saying is just, you know, it just they try to say something, and what that is what we're expecting. You know, we're expecting them to say something, and the Reverend Father that uh, come out and say that the IPOB is IPOB. You know, some of the Reverend Fathers, some of the Reverend Fathers, they are already you know, they are already used. You know, they are using them, and they know what is coming to them. How can the Reverend Father come out and say that IPOB that says it at home? You know, sit at home and fighting for sit at home. Is this sit at home? Is this anywhere you see in in, in where that people come and come to the house? What is the problem of, of those reverend fathers? Those 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 gay reverend fathers. We know them, and when they are rich, they all going to disappear on the surface of the earth. Thank you, my great people, and God bless the Afghan. God bless our leader, Mas Namdik, and he's a great, a great thing. And the Afghan will surely come in our time. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Biafra will surely come in our time. Call on the phone. Hello. Hello. Yeah, good morning. What's name? Where are you calling from? Hello. Hello. Can you hear me? All right. To have another call out there. Hello. Call on the phone. <coughs> call on the phone. Are you there? Okay, we we'll we'll lost the call. Please do call back. Let's hear your um, contribution because it matters a lot. It's very important we hear from you. We have um, some minutes to go. We have about 20 minutes to go. So please call us and let's hear from you. Let's know what your contribution is or what is going on in your area. Hello, call on the phone. Mm -hmm. Hello, call on the phone, are you there? We have another call out there. Hello. Oh. Um, well done, God. There we are. Welcome to yes. the Yeah. Are you talking to me? Well done, God. Yeah, I'm talking to Hello. you. Go ahead. Okay. Hello. Please, can you go ahead? Thank you, listening to his advice. We have another call out there on the phone. Hello. Hello. Can you turn down the volume of your listening device, please? Hello. We can hear you. Okay, call out WhatsApp. Hello. Hello. Yeah, what's the name? Where are you calling from? Can you please speak up? We can't hear you. All right, call on the phone. Hello. Hello good morning. Good morning. What's the name? Are you calling? Good morning. Well done, you? Good morning to you. I'm as fine, you come to the program. I'm not alone. I think I'm 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 alone. Nekleba <laughs> Just <laughs> I'm about to go and see the number of cars we're about to see. About today, today, this morning, but I get a lot of time. All the things I see, now I get one of the the friends. We who go about to see who, so we open up the door and we're more. When I'm in the court, we see a certain item. No person get me now for a car now. I get one of the friends. In fact, I'm here now to learn math. That's why I'm here to see the leader. To go and see how much I know about it. They will. They will. Thank you very much. Of course, uh, we remain resolute. Biafra must be restored. 
uh, whether they like it or not. Biafra must be restored. Okay, please call us and let's hear from you. What's your contribution? What do you think? And uh, of course, um, what is going on in your area? Hello, call on WhatsApp. Yeah, good morning, Madam Rosika. Good morning to you. Welcome to the program. Thank you. Good morning, Mazi Victor. How you doing? And good morning, uh, good morning, what? Mazi Ellis. We thank you, people, for what you people is doing for us, dear friends. May Chukwu Kikam be and bless all of you. Yes. Guide you, you, all of you, and protect all of you. Yes. In the name of Chukwu Kikam be and you are very much and you are coming here. Yes. Chukwu Kikam be and will guide you, people. So my my name is Chile Bela. I'm coming from Paris, France. Uh, we we hit the streets on the 30th May. We did it, and the. We see what happened in the airport now. We thank Chukwu Kikabiyama for everything. So my contribution this morning is concerning the, what the analyst uh, you, you people did on the television concerning the the, the police saying that IPU be killed uh, uh, five people or so, something like that. Uh, I want to let all their friends to know that the Nigerian government have failed. They have failed and they are ashamed of themselves. So they know that they cannot stop IPOB anymore. IPOB is moving forward. IPOB is setting agenda to them. So they are trying any means, any means with their Yoruba Gota media to bring IPOB back or to distract IPOB. But we know them. We are not going to fall on their trap. We know that the city at home is for international community, everybody. Because on that yet May, the Facebook is filled up with information coming out from Biafra land. We saw the videos. We saw all the pictures. So we are not, we are not after the Yoruba Bhutan here because even the world has started knowing that the Yoruba, the NBC, the NBC, that controls uh, Nigerian media is threatening all of them. The one that are threatening, uh, our leader said that they are threatening, uh, uh, what they call it, uh, DSTV. This is the way they are threatening all of them. Well, they threaten you like, like a source of uh, a man uh, 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 on, the, uh, the, uh, on the internet, Facebook. He said that, he, he, that they are trying to write uh, about the, 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 the Asabajuno site. No, they are trying to make a topic on uh, uh, as a major time. They have they received a phone call from NBC that they should shut the they should stop it, call them off. They call them off on the video, they post on the So they don't want to, to talk anything about Biafra. They are afraid of Biafra. They are, they are afraid of talking everything everything concerning Biafra. So but we don't give we don't give a damn about them. We don't give a damn about their news. We will write our history. We are the people that are going to have right our history. So we are moving forward. We are moving forward because we know that the people they say that uh, the priest was shot is the police that are out that every day. The police said they make it that they are going to protect the life, uh, uh, the life of their citizens. So if anything happened to that family, uh, if something like that happened, know that the police are the people that did it. They just want to blackmail. They just want to distract IPOB. So we know them. We know we are we are not after their news. They should go ahead, go go to hell with their news. We know that Nigeria media is fake. It's fake. The news they are bringing is fake. So we are not interested of their news. So I thank all the officers that that did the status for the rest at work during that status of men. I and bless all of them. They will never lack. They will never lack. Anything the people that are selling. Anything they bring up, they will sell it. God will fulfill them in hundred fools. So thank you and God bless all of you in the name of Chukwu Kabiyama and God bless the Afras. Bless our leader. Bless our deputy. Our deputy. Bless Mazi Onibe, the infatigable Mazi Onibe, our African rep. God will bless him for what he's doing for us. Thank you and God bless you. Thank you. Thank you very much for that uh, contribution. Hello. Call on the phone. Hello. Hello. Yeah, what city are you calling from? Hello. 
Can you hear me? I hope you're not listening to your device. Okay. Hello. Um, All right. Good, uh, good morning, Madam Godwin. May we know your name and where you're calling from? Yeah, um, my name is uh, Mark I'm calling from Madrid. I'm calling from Madrid. So I have a short period uh, to talk to, to, to speak right now. I just want to make mention um, speak about the. the Are you still there? Okay, we'll ask the call. Please do call back so that we can um, hear from you. Hello, call on WhatsApp. I'll call it down. My radio is, um, is not all that loud. Okay, go ahead. What's the name? Where are you calling? Yeah, I just wanted to thank every. I am Mike by name. I'm calling from Russia. Okay. Um, I just wanted to thank every BF and every IPO member for faithfully um, observing the the 30th May Remembrance Day of our fallen hero, heroes, brother. I send a God bless every each and every one of us. And then may he still continue to to grant us the strength and then the perseverance to go after this Biafra with everything that we have. And there is no due sign that it shall come to full job. I thank you all, those of you in the studio, working assiduously hard every night, every day. I really don't know all the signing, but as the Uchime for um, you guys, Ngozi, Victor, and Mazumi, the ones in UH, those have been working so hard faithfully to see to it that we have um, our country, our nation be restored. restored. I pray that God will bless you all in his infinite mercy and then guide us the grace that we will continue in this path. And when be is restored, we will you find that it shall be given unto everyone to stay and enjoy our life. God bless you all. Thank you. Bless you see, bless you too. Thank you very much. Thank you. Call on the phone. Hello. Hello, call on the phone. Can you hear me? Hello. What's the name? Where are you calling Hello. from? We can hear you. Go ahead. Good morning, Gozi. Good morning to you. Wait. I can't hear you. Yeah. Good morning, Gozi. Can you hear me now? I hope you're not listening to your device. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, happy sister too. Thank you, thank you. Hello, uh, I want to. My name is uh, Ma I'm calling from uh, Zimbabwe in a, uh, a boy, a boy province. Anyway, I thank you people for the job that you people are doing for our nation. Yeah, in fact, I was uh, more than happy. Watching the, the the event that took place on uh, that end. we have come to stay and nothing, no going back. The Afro must be come rain, come storm. We are we we stick our neck on it, and uh, at last we will actualize the Afro. We will restore our nation, the Afro, because there is no way that we can say yes. We are going to align with Nigeria again. No, gone are the days of that. There is no way we can go back to Nigeria. We must fight hard. Everybody, let everybody, I think, everybody should, every hand must be on deck for us to uh, uh, realize this, our dream of uh, the African restoration. And I thank you for all the job so far, because the world has now recognized us. The, the world has now known that uh, the Afra exists with the happening and uh, it's continue happening day by day so i thank you people and uh, i urge you people to continue doing this good work that you are doing continue propagating that gospel of Biafra all over the world one day surely Biafra must come thank you very much for all the effort thank you thank you thank you Colon skype hello Hello, good morning. Good morning to you. What's the name and where are you calling from? 
Yeah, thank you very much. Uh, my name is Chukwe. I'm calling from Italy. I say, may Chukwe Kikabema bless you and give you more strength to continue the job because the heart of this project is the media. Uh, through media, we communicate ourselves, we say other problems, we know where to start and where to go. Uh, you people piloting the media are doing a marvelous job. May Elohim give you more strength to continue until the Biafra will be restored. You see? Uh, I want to, to say something this morning. First of all, let me thank our brothers and sisters, those from the those that went from Iwanke Market, I saw them. Those were in Asaba, everywhere shut down. A lot of things they have did in Ugocha and all the, all the rest of the other lands. I thank them because they are the people taking the heat, those in the zoo and those in the Biafra land. Uh, freedom is not easy and it's not given, it's taken. And we are working towards to take our freedom and that should, it must come to pass. Uh, there's something important I want to say, please, my dear. You, this thing, I'm just highlighting this into IPOB hierarchy also. And uh, I wish if this thing will be done, I will be so excited, so happy. All this our program, IPOB program, all the one from the beginning should be put in a place, in a book. It will be written down in a book that our generation will come after us, will read about it. And then um, secondly, our history and the history of the zoo, some partial history of the zoo that consigns Biafra that led to the war should be put in a book that even in the due time, our children will stop them in the school, not it in the school. So growing up with your history will make you to know who you are. Because why we are, this generation seems to be so we li likely to be fair and initially, if not at the presence of our, the emergence of our leader, we have almost failed. But the emergence of our leader has helped us to rise up again. Because we don't know history of the zoo, even our own history, even our relatives from the Isoko area and all this, uh, we lost all these things because we don't have any documentation consigned it. But today, thank our leader that has brought us to the table. But I would like all this thing to be documented, put in a book that even the generation to come tomorrow will read about it and they will know they, where they came from. Thank you. This is my um, contribution this morning. May Elohim bless everyone working. I saw a leader this morning. He was in Canada and USA holding our people and meeting. I thank him for every job he's doing. Thank you very much. Elohim bless every one of us. Thank you. Thank you, my brother, and uh, Mitchko Kabba, bless you for that wonderful contribution. All right, we have a call on WhatsApp. Call on WhatsApp, good morning. Hello, call on WhatsApp, are you there? Yeah, I'm here. Okay, please tell us your name and where you're calling from. All right. Yeah, good morning, dear friends. My name is Darren Nogona, and I'm calling from Australia. I uh, just want to say my love and congratulations to the people of Yafra for a successful day of heart. We're proud of you all for the effort you put it in. And a special thanks to those women that protested. I'm not sure whether that was in Watch or somewhere. But um, I was really moved to see uh, the determination in their faces, you know. Both in the country, there's uh, not being afraid of the army and the police, you know, for them to have done what they did. I think that was the courage to every single one of us. So, uh, once again, my love and congratulations to the people of your friends. God bless you all. Bye. I'm blessed you too. Thank you very much, and uh, we really appreciate you for that wonderful contribution. All right. We we'll have a call on the phone. Hello, call on the phone. Good morning. Please turn down the volume of your listening device. Please turn it way down before you call this line so that we can have effective communication. Turn it down, cut them off. All right, keep the calls coming in. We have a call on WhatsApp. Call, call on WhatsApp. Good morning. Hello, good morning. Uh, good morning. Tell us your name. Yeah, you're calling. Good morning. Good morning. Tell us yeah, uh, uh, I say good morning. Uh, uh, call, on the phone. call on the phone. Good morning. Hello. Hello. Call on the phone. Good morning. Hello. 
Hello? I can hear you, please. Tell us your name and where you are calling from. Good morning. Good morning and welcome to the program. Please tell us your name and make your contribution. Um, my name is uh, Mazi Augustine Uchechku Madakolam. I am calling you from uh, Masarawa State. All right, uh, Mazi Austin. It's been a long time. How are you doing? Yes, a long time, Mazi. You, you are my boss, you are my mentor, and you know that. I want to start by appreciating our ego leader, Mazi Nambikanu, uh, his deputy, Mazi Uchemefo, and um, to our African rep, and to you, my boss in the media, I want to tell you that we so much appreciate and know what really happened on the 30th of May. This is to tell the zoo that we are ready to go and we are not more coming to rub hands with them or pretend that everything is all right the gospel truth still remains that these people don't want to allow us because most of them are ignorant and they don't care about life i believe they just want to keep sucking what is in our land because of the illness and sickness that food in their own community diabetes and all of that so they need that money so that they will continue to take care of themselves. I really want to thank Mazin Nambikanu for our we never stop thinking about Biafra until Biafra comes. Mazin, let me allow other people to talk and um, the National State uh, really saying thank you for everything you are doing for us. Thank All you right, very thank much. Thank you very much and we do appreciate you. All right. And I extend my regards to National State family. Thank you. All right, Colon, what's up? Hello. Hello, Colon, what's up? Can you hear me? Hello, everybody. You are there. You are welcome to the I program. Go ahead. Good morning. Ask Colon for today. Good morning, my girl. Good morning. Uh, I'm blessed to talk about the work that I said. Good morning. Good afternoon, good evening, and good night for the of us. My name is Samuel, I'm speaking from the city of Mozambique this morning. I want to appreciate the people who are here for the successful starting of my celebration in Maputo and all around the world, more especially in the African I want to commend all my brothers and sisters in the African land what they do on target of me and all around the world. And I say my name to the day I be on the day in our life and generation to come. I want to also thank our leader, Marvin Nandi Kano, for all you have done for the African and friends of the African who have succeeded in the target of me. I say my name to the all of us and our for effort to see that the Biafra Reservation is continuity. And I also want to use this opportunity to call my brothers and sisters who are still sitting in the front, more especially from my town, where I come from Nanka in the upper province of Biafra land. So please stand and wake up and join this struggle so that together we shall restore our nation Biafra. As we do this, and the young people, as we come out to tell IPAB, that act, stop asking questions for what we are doing. Come out and, come and join and see what we are doing. So we can restore this nation of Biafra, our last time. As we do this, we should God that must strengthen us and bless all our endeavors. We must be able to God them our prayers. We say, we say, we say, we say, I think that we see God of us, all the Biafra. Jaffa will help thee. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. And uh, we'll be able to draw in the curtain here for today. But before we go, uh, Master Victor, in, in one minute, what message do you have for us? Okay. Thank you very much, uh, Mother. Um, of course, uh, defense and all of us of freedom, listening and watching all over the world. Uh, congratulations, I must say, to each and every one of us, those of you in diaspora who did us proud by coming out in your numbers to identify with what we are doing. We are really appreciate. And those of you in Biafran land, Asim Aka Onuwea, 
Well, uh, this is the time for us to stay, keep on keeping on. Our vision is to restore Biafra and nothing more, nothing less. Don't be distracted by the Yoruba hand envelope media and the lies they are churning out every day because we have our people on ground who is giving us the jack of what is going on and uh, we are formidable people. So I really just, I'm overwhelmed. I'm just, I don't know what else to say. I just want to appreciate you all and to tell you that we should keep on keeping on. Uh, everybody with one one percent solution will solve a problem, but one person with hundred percent solution can never solve the problem. So keep on uh, coming out, and uh, Biafra will be here in, in, in no distant time. Thank you very much, Anwada. Thank you. Thank you so much. All right, Mazi Elvis. Uh, in one minute, also, can you um, address IPOB families and also everyone who is watching this program this morning before we go? Okay. Um, First and uh, foremost, I want to show appreciation, gratitude, and um, heart with um, gladness to the IPOB family worldwide. We have been able to put the devil to where he belongs. And um, I want to say a very big thank you to every one of us that has honored and uh, commemorate our heroes which will them and continue to bless you all because you remember those that the, uh, uh, the zoo has killed you yourself will not die young and you will live to see Biafra you see? and because of this people will celebrate you all you see? then I want to say again to Biafrans all over the world keep it up because there is this adage in Hebrew language that says, Onya siya jide koji, manu de mo fuma. Onya siya koji, manu de mo fuma. That is, it means, if we are giving you a college, it means you need to do more. Because to whom much is given, much is expected. Which means you need to maintain your velocity. You need to maintain and abide by the law of our leader, the law of our leader so that we will get to our destination Thank because you. he said that before the end of this very year and he's a man of his word that Biafra will have his referendum. Please. All right. Thank you very much. Don't allow. Thank you so much. Because of our time, we will be drawing the curtain here. To our viewers out there, we say to you, thank you for joining us. And stay tuned as more wonderful programs will be coming your way. I remain Ngozi Chukwoka. Bye for now.